Hey guys, so I know I'm looking hot and dangerous fresh out of the shower, but yeah, I got out of the shower and it's stupid to get dressed and put on makeup for a video, especially if you just got out of the shower. But I'm going to show you my monthly favorites and yeah. So if you've ever watched any of my other favorites videos, you're going to know what I'm going to show and it is my Naked palette. I am still using this. Um, I got it the beginning of this year. Not sure the exact day, but I have been using it 98% of the days since, and it's just amazing. I'm not even going to talk about it even more, except they have a Naked Palette 2. Um, I was about to order it, um, then my internet went down, and like 15 minutes later I came back, and no, it was sold out. So I'm so mad. I've been using Sin a lot, and I've also been using Buck a lot. And I've been starting to use Hustle. Yeah, Hustle a lot again. If you're not sure if you should get it, I, you should get it. Or it's a really nice um, Christmas gift. Next favorite is the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. Um, and I previously had the gel, but I ran out. And my face is getting really, really dry. And um, some of my friends suggested that I should get the lotion because it's more moisturizing. And it is. And my face has not been flaking. Ugh. I'm sorry, my email. And my face has not been flaking since I've been using this, and I really love this. So, I'm going in a really random order, but it's the L'Oreal Studio Secrets Matching Perfecting Base. I don't know if they still sell this. I got this last year around the holidays. Um, it's just this, and then you open it, it's like a pink jelly base. But it's supposed to be a primer, and it's supposed to like minimize your pores. I don't know if it does that, but I've been, like, I don't wear foundation, but I wear some concealer. And I found that if I apply this like under my eyes and on my nose, my concealer goes on a lot smoother and it looks a lot nicer. I've been using Erase Paste by Benefit and this is a sample. So I, it's not a sample, it came in like a pack of something. I don't even know what it was from, but if you can see how much I've used, like I've had this for a while, but like it's not worth to get the big one because you're never gonna use that much. So if you see it in a pack, I think it's worth it to get it in a pack. But I've been using this on my nose and on any, any blemishes and I think it covers them really well and yeah. Um, and then I've been using my Bare Essentials Concealer Brush for it. It's been working well. And I've been loving my fluffy brushes. This is just one, one from Target and I'm thinking about um, investing in like a nice one like from MAC or Sigma or something. But I'll do that eventually. Um, but I've just been using this a lot. Like I've been using it pretty much like this is the only brush I'll use in the morning for my eyes. So I've just been loving a fluffy brush. If you've also seen my other favorites videos, you know that I loved um, my e.l.f. eyeliner. And um, it, dry it was drying up, so I needed to buy a new one. So I got this, and it doesn't have anything on the side. But it is the L'Oreal Linear Intense in Carbon Black. Um, and I have the liquid, I don't know, liquid, something like that. And what it is, is just like a black liquid liner with like a brush. And it's like really, really black. And I've been loving this and it stays on all day. The only thing is you have to be really careful when you apply it. Because if your hand bumps, then you kind of like mess up your eyeliner and then it gets messed up. But I've been really loving this. I've been loving this. Carmex Cherry Moisturizing Lip Balm. My mom actually got this for me. And yeah, that's what it looks like. And I it just really moisturizes my lips well. And it smells, I guess it smells like cherry, but it reminds me of some smell, but I can't think of what it is. And it's just like clear. And it like, it doesn't tingle my lips, but it's just like, they just feel really nice, really moisturizing. So if you're looking for a chapstick, this is from the drugstore, I don't know how much it is. I've been reaching for my Painterly Paint Pot a lot um, by MAC, and if you can see, I've made a fairly large dent in it. Yep. Um, and I've been using this as a base, and I've been loving it. I've also been reaching for my Stila Lip Stain in Pomegranate Crush, which is just this, and then you open it, it looks like that. Um, and this is just a lip stain because I find in the morning, like, I do my makeup, then I go downstairs, and then I have breakfast usually like in the car or on my way out the door. So I don't really like to put on lipstick because I find that it comes off, but this provides just enough color and it stays on. The thing is my Vera Wang Princess Perfume, 
which smells so good and I just found myself reaching towards this a lot. Jewelry this month, I found myself wearing these earrings a lot. Um, I have them in this like turquoise color and I have them in this like pale pink color and I've just been wearing them a lot because they match with a lot of things and they just really look really nice. Also when I was in Europe, I just remembered I got them in purple but don't know where those are. Um, and when I get home from school, I don't really like to deal with my hair because it's just annoying so I um, every day I'll put it up and then I'll put a headband like this on and these is just like they're just like this um, and they're just coming like a five pack from like scrunchie whatever you say that brand and I've just been loving this because it holds my hair back and really nice that sound really weird but I've had a favorite pencil this month so um, is this pencil let me see if it has a name on it Sparker Insignia I don't know if that's the name of the pencil or what but it's just a really nice mechanical pencils I don't like wood pencils but I really like mechanical pencils but I'm, I had like mechanical pencils and I mean there wasn't anything wrong with it but then um my physics teacher was helping me um and he was using like he had a really nice pencil like this and it just made me like want a pencil like that so badly and this writes so much better and the lines are just so much smaller and crisper and it's just so much more precise and it sounds weird but I'm telling you, it makes a difference. Um, I don't know if I've ever included this in a favorites video before, but I'm going to include the songs I've been loving this month. So yeah, um, don't forget to enter into our giveaway and see you guys later. Bye!